Hey guys, welcome to my channel and welcome back to another Hamilton episode. I am really excited for today's episode. We're here with the Skylar sisters, Angelica drinking some water and Eliza eating her whatever that food is. Is it mac and cheese? Is Jefferson already here? No, he's not, <laughs> but he's going to be here at some point. <laughs> anyway, today I am doing some Skylar sister dating because we're visiting the butler since we haven't seen him in a while, but we're also having Eliza visit Burr. So that's sort of what is happening today. More news on the Hamilton, the Lambs engagement soon. There's going to be a vote on that in this episode. So, uh, it's, it's happening. So don't worry. But today we're focusing on the Skylar sisters and their potential boyfriends a little more uh obviously angelica hasn't seen the butler in a little while with everything happening at her father's house but now that she's here she went on a camping trip cleared her head and realized she actually still really really likes the butler so i guess today we are visiting him so let's go okay so this is where the butler currently lives and this family was actually created for me by using the sim storytime worlds uh hashtag more info on that in the description but this house was also created for me and this is the house where historically if i'm correct this was in the description so i'm just going by that eliza lived when she met alexander hamilton uh so there's not much Eliza and Hamilton action going on at the moment, but I did want one of the Skyler sisters to fall in love while being in this house. So that is why I put this family and the butler in this lot, <laughs> in this house. Uh, I also gave the butler a new name because I could have remembered his name the entire time. So his name is now Nathan. Nice and simple and something I can remember because I'm horrible with remembering things like seriously. But anyway, so that's what we're doing today. He's just a butler living in their house at the moment, obviously relocated because it wasn't really working out at the Skyler sister household. And I feel like this family is treating him a lot more nicely it's more like he's a part of the family and just living there for free in like return of him cleaning up a little bit uh more than him being like a butler to them it's more like he's part of the family he's just repaying them by doing some work around the house i feel like that's more the dynamic in this house so let's visit him okay so here we are at the butler's house or i guess the house he's living in currently and i feel like angelica would be quite nervous oh my god he's flirty uh that's the like the the dad of the house they're all flirty just because um it has a romantic aura so yeah nothing weird going on uh <laughs> but anyway knock on the door and see if the butler is still interested in her because it had been quite a while obviously for him it feels like she just left while well, he knew what was going on with her dad and everything so i guess it makes sense with everything that's been going on okay well she's let in so let's see if the butler is around oh this is quite exciting it's been a really really long time i'm actually really excited to be back um where is he imagine him just not being home well uh Oh, there he is! Okay, so... I think he joined the painting career, and that is why he's looking like that. Um, but yeah, so his name is now Nathan Newberry. <laughs> Literally just randomized. Okay, well, let's see what we can do. Um, call over. We can, because he's too far away. Okay, well, something... What, what would be, like, the first thing you do... Ask to move in. Ask to just be friends. No. Um, what would be the first thing you do? Get to know. Deep conversation. No, we know him, right? Do we know everything? But probably hug him. It's been a really long time. So we probably like hug him. And we're like, oh my god, we're back. I'm so excited. Okay, we'll do friendly. And then see if we can find the hug interaction. There we go. Okay, there we go. And I probably like a heartfelt compliment. I don't know. Let's let's just see this happening first. Take some screenshots. Really pretty house, by the way. I didn't even know that I what is that? I don't I didn't know I had that. <laughs> She's here. Yay, that's so cute. I didn't realize that she was, was already here. I was like confused by the furniture in this. Oh, he's confident. That's good. <laughs> I think it's kind of cute that he's like um I don't know, reveal a deep secret, probably talking about what the hell has happened. Oh, she's also confident. That's so cute. Oh, God. Oh, that's the entire family. She's meeting the family. Well, it's not his family, but, you know, let's see if she likes them. The, the family he is living with now. 
Uh, let's do a friendly introduction. Let's move down these walls. I'm not really getting in any good screenshots anyway. Uh, let's do a friendly introduction to them too. Because, you know, Angelica is really polite. And she'd like to get to know the family that took him in. Aww. They're all getting to know each other. Also, I changed her hair. For the person who created her, I did change her hair. Um, just because I had this CC hair that I really liked on her. <laughs> okay. Well, um... This has been fun, and Angelica's probably like, Hi, nice to meet you. Can I borrow your butler for a second? Um, or, I guess, new family member. Make funny faces. That's so cute. Okay, well, let's do more choices. Actions. Add to a group. So they'll be together, and now I can uh, get them away from this whole situation. Get them somewhere over here. Maybe sit down together. It's like a bench. A bench is more cute. Um... We could go here, but it's pretty close to the house. Well, whatever. She wouldn't want to take the butler away for too long. Or Nathan. I really need to say Nathan now. Okay, we'll sit together. Okay, so they're now over here. And I made them change back into their normal outfit. Or for his his butler outfit and her like formal or like everyday dress. But it's a little more form formal. Uh, I don't know. They probably want to impress each other a little bit. Since, you know, it's like a beginning relationship. They have a pretty big friendship and they are lovebird cur lovebirds currently. Um, do we want them to like be official? Tickle mercilessly. That's so cute. Maybe kiss him. Oh, where are you? Where is he going? Don't leave us here. <laughs> what are you doing? No, literally. What is he doing? Why is he just okay? Okay, so he's back. So we compl We are going to compliment his appearance. Uh, we are going to blow a kiss, probably. Maybe confess her attraction. Being like, okay, I really, really, really like you. Uh, but I also... So here's the thing. Do we want them to be official? Because currently they are not official. But do we want them to be like actual like boyfriend, girlfriends? Should we vote on that? Let's vote on that. So in the eye in the corner, you can vote right now if we want them to become like officially boyfriend, girlfriends. Or are they going to stay like lovebirds, not really define anything. I also have this plan in mind and tell me if this is crazy. But I kind of want Angelica to accidentally become pregnant maybe in the future maybe that's a new drama thing we can do let me know what you think of that maybe that's like crazy and like angelica would never do that what are you talking about they are very very cute also this neighborhood is really pretty but look at them they're so cute oh <laughs> i really like this relationship like it's not something that is necessarily in the musical or in the story or historically correct or whatever but it's it is really cute <laughs> And I think they fit really well together. Let's actually look at his, at his, at his traits one more time uh, before we go do something else. Because I saw an interaction that I kind of want to try. Uh, <laughs> which might be like crazy. Um, let's see his traits for a second. So his traits are bro, creative and unknown. Oh, we need to know one of his traits? I forgot. I know his traits because I saw him in creative sim. But I thought Angelica knew his traits too. Well, let's get to know him then get to know and then i saw another interaction that i it's kind of scandalous so bear with me but it's like it's kind of something i want to try <laughs> he's a bookworm yes 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 it's perfect they're perfect together and he's he would fit so in so well with the entire try for baby yeah no i want to woo in the closet <laughs> i know that's kind of weird but I kind I also kind of want to do it <laughs> oh my god I can't believe I'm actually doing this this is so unlike me to do like in the last episode I was talking about woohooing in tents and now we're woohooing in closets what what is happening to me I don't know anymore oh my god this is quite wow that's very scandalous <laughs> I did not remember that interaction being so extreme uh but anyway that's what they're doing so let's uh, switch over to eliza and see if we can have some alone time with burr <laughs> okay so here they are in the park in semi shuno because obviously eliza really likes to go into the city <laughs> 
and look for mine at work. Uh, <laughs> but anyway, not of kind of Angelica. But I am here in a really, really, really pretty spot. And we voted on how quick we want this relationship to go. And the the outcome of that vote was that we wanted it to go really quickly. And to me, this is one of those relationships where they just... Um, they fall in love with the idea of love. Um, so they feel like they fit really well together and they're going to have like a really good relationship and oh my god, this is the best thing ever. And then they figure out that maybe they're not really right for each other, but it goes really quickly because they're in the beginning, they're just convinced that this is the best thing ever. Obviously, Eliza had like corrupt motivations from the start, so uh, it's not going to go too well. But let's flirt for the first time. Let's flirt ask if he's single uh, and do some romantic romantic stuff because they don't have a romance romance bar at all sorry i cannot talk today it's embarrassing okay uh let's ask if he's single do some friendly things some flirty things and maybe get their first kiss right away i don't know why i want that to happen but obviously we wanted to go really quickly so i feel like you know having a first kiss is not even the craziest idea ever so let's see if we can do that. Oh my god. First flirts. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> That's really cute. I, I I don't know. Something about this. I, I know it's not going to work. They just don't feel right for each other. I know that there's a lot of Mariah and Eliza. Oh no. Why is this always happening to us? Why is this? Is she, is she singing? <laughs> Why are you practicing your singing? What are you doing? Also, can you leave, please? You're kind of interrupting like an important moment here. <sighs> My God, this is such a mess of an episode. Sometimes just this, this stuff just happens and I can't really do anything about it. But I hope you still enjoy the episode anyway. <laughs> oh my God, she cannot sing at all. Seriously, you can't hear this right now, but it's terrible. <laughs> I need to... Oh, God. Don't embarrass yourself, Eliza, please. <laughs> she needs to work on that because she can sing. Because she, she should be able to s sing. Well, flirt a little. Maybe you can do that. <laughs> do a heartfelt compliment. We need to work on her piano skill and her singing skill. But not right now. Um, no, actually, I want to do romance. What kind of romance stuff can we do? Let's do a pickup line. Let's exchange numbers. No, that's always really quick. Maybe not. I'm... I'm curious to see how fast I can get their Roman's bar up. Compliment his appearance, maybe? Well, let's see how this is going to turn out. I'm wondering how long it's going to take before they even have a Roman's bar. Well, he's into it. That's good. It's so pretty out here. I want screenshots. <laughs> I mean, look at that. Oh, look at how pretty it is with like the whole like city in the background. This reminds me of like Central Park or like a skyline or whatever. I don't know. It's really pretty. Oh, I don't know. They're cute. They're just not right for each other. Oh, Burr. Burr. Is Burr working right now? I feel like this is like a work call and Eliza's just over here trying really hard. I don't know, guys. Yeah, they have a romance bar. They have a romance bar. They have a romance bar. What are you doing, Burr? I'm, I mean, they're just doing... They're doing, like, other stuff. He's browsing the web and Eliza's, like, singing, practicing your singing. I don't know why they're doing this. I don't know why my sins are doing this, but they're flirty. They're both flirty. It's just... I don't know. Hold his hands, blow a kiss. We do have more interactions now. And um, offer a rose. That's really cute. Um, sexy pose. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. More choices. We have more stuff to do now. Kisses hands. I kind of wanted to do like some other way round stuff too. Uh, let's kiss hands. And uh, I kind of want to see Burr do a sexy pose. <laughs> Am I the only one? <laughs> Because I kind of really want that. Okay, let's see him do a sexy pose. I'm, I'm, I will see. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> this is such a disaster. It's cute though. It's a cute disaster, but it's a disaster nonetheless. <laughs> oh, I mean, I don't know. Something about it just, just doesn't really work out. And still, they're cute, but they're like, oh god, is this sexy pose? This is sexy pose. <laughs> you guys. I don't know what is wrong with me today. Okay, well, we saw do bird, we saw bird do some sexy poses. Uh, and what better way to end this episode? <laughs> I don't know anymore. Help. <laughs>
<laughs> okay, this was such a mess of an episode, but I hope you liked it anyway. And if you did, don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you haven't yet. And if you're, you really, really, really want to help me out, you can click the notification bell to get notified when there is a new uh, video up. Sorry. <laughs> oh my god, they're literally both on their phone right now. What? I don't know anymore. I don't know what is happening. I don't know why they're like... I don't know why they're convinced that this is a good idea when they're literally both like, eh, I don't know, I'm bored. <laughs> Let's look at my phone. Or maybe it's awkward. Maybe they just don't. She's practicing singing again. Again. Seriously. Eliza. Oh my God. I don't know with these two. I don't know. I don't know. It's going to be such a short lived relationship because it's literally already not going great. It's like Eliza really wants to impress him and Bert's like, oh yeah, no, I'm just looking at twitter and <laughs> stalking uh, the other social media profiles like he's probably looking at lafayette's <laughs> social media profile hoping that he can get into the group uh and being kind of like an outsider i don't know anyway uh this video was a really big mess oh they're taking a picture together that's kind of cute <laughs> this video is a really big mess but i hope you liked it anyway and if you did don't forget to like this video and comments leaving your suggestions and also subscribing and clicking the notification bell if you are if you are if you are already subscribed because it really 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 helps out my channel and thank you so much for all the support that this series has has gotten <laughs> but i'm going to end this episode here so i hope you liked it and as always thank you so much for watching and i will see you very soon goodbye